Hi, it's Priscilla Ivler with Stampin' Amigos, and I just wanted to give you a little tip on how to stamp with your very large photopolymer stamps. This is from Among the Branches, a new set that's going to be in the holiday catalog. Can't wait to show everybody. But occasionally when you're stamping this, you'll find that your um, stamps don't quite fill in the entire thing. So we've got a little space over here, and down here we had a couple of little spots. And over here we've got another one. I wanted to show you a really quick tip on how you can get a really good stamp every time with your photopolymer, very solid stamps, the big wide flat ones. Here's my piece of Whisper White. I'm going to start with my spooky stamp and this I'm going to be inking up in Tangelo Twist. One thing I've found is that if you put your stamp down you can kind of watch your ink pick up and just lightly press in the center until you have all of that stamp, that ink uh, picked up on your stamp and I like to do it once or twice Then I'm going to take it and just take a quick look and make sure that everything looks inked up really well And it does so I'm going to go ahead and stamp I like to make sure that the ink transfers but again over here You're going to see where there's a little spot that isn't quite right So pick up your paper the paper comes right with your photopolymer stamp and underneath just give it a little press kind of just rub it around like so all the way around and when you take that off you've got a perfect perfect stamp we'll do another one doing one in mossy meadow again as I put this down watch the ink pick up you can just pick it up and just give it a slight press in the center all the way around making sure you have ink on the entire stamp I like to just set it down one more time I'm going to just make a quick exam on the back and make sure it looks like it's inked all the way around. And then I'll set it down. And as I stamp, you can watch the ink transfer. I got a spot in the middle, it looks like it's not quite there. So I'm gonna pick it up, flip it over, give it a little rub. And there we are, sheer perfection. Wanna try one more time? Let's do it our winter one, Making Spirits Bright and Night of Navy. Again, I set it down, give a little press, press one more time, just make a little check and make sure everything looks good. I'm going to go ahead and give it a stamp, pick up my paper, oh, well, that one actually worked fine, but I just, <laughs> there you go. So. Worked out well. I had just re-inked my, my ink pad, so it looks like it was good. And then I'll be punching this out, so I'm not going to worry about the little mark at the bottom. Anyway, there you go. Quick tip on how to do this. Get a nice, clean, flat stamp, solid surface stamp to stamp all the way, every time. Come on, and, come on by my blog and visit me at stampinamigos.com. Thanks.